The Story of a Pencil by Paulo Coelho A boy was watching his grandmother write a letter. At one point, he asked, Are you writing a story about what we've done? Is it a story about me? I am writing about you. Actually, but more important than the words in the pencil I'm using. I hope you will be like this pencil when you grow up. Intrigued, the boy looked at the pencil. I didn't seem a very special. It's just like any other pencil I've ever seen. That depends on how you look at things. It has five qualities which, if you manage to hang on them, will you make a person who is always at peace with the world. First quality, you are capable of great things, but you must never forget that there is a hand guiding your step. We call that hand God, and He always guides us according to His will. Second quality, now and then, I have to stop writing and use a sharpener. That makes the pencil suffer a little, but afterwards, he's much sharper. So you too must learn to bear certain pains and sorrows, because they will make you better pen- Third quality, the pencil always allows us to use an eraser to rub out any mistake. This means that correcting something with it is not necessarily a bad thing. It helps to keep us on the road to justice. Quality, what really matters in a pencil is not its wooden exterior, but the graphile inside. So always pay attention to what is happening inside you. Finally, the pencil fifth quality. It always leaves a mark. In just the same way, you should know that everything you do in life will leave a mark. So try to be conscious of that in your every action.